Hello, hello, fam. Welcome. My name is Magdalene Janet. If you're new, welcome to the fam. Please don't forget to like and subscribe because we're always here having a good time. And come visit me on TikTok and Instagram because I'm there daily. And of course, welcome back to my oldies uh, goodies. You guys, guess what I got? Shout out to Valentino for sending me this PR box, this set of lipstick. Oh my God, it looks like a purse. Look. So this set is available at Neiman Marcus. The lipsticks here that come individually are also available at Sephora. So if you wanna get one individually, it's there too. And I'm gonna be swatching all five of these shades. I'm gonna be switching it out because these are all refillable lipsticks. Oh my God. So as you guys know, I have nothing on my lips and I'm so freaking excited because we love lipsticks here. I've never tried Valentino's lipsticks before and oh my god thank you to Valentino for sending me these so I could show to you and okay if you are not familiar with my lip swatches welcome to the fam I typically do lip swatches in studio lighting and in daylight so you guys can see the true true color of how the lipsticks look and I don't ever wear anything on my lips so again you can see like the true trueness you know you guys today is like the only day of the week it's gonna be sunny so I'm so excited because it's super sunny out today so you can see how things look and I'm not sure if I'm gonna do an eat test because these look like they are creamy lipsticks we'll see how the video goes so yeah without further ado let's get started all right familia this is how the package looks it's a cute little box we open it up these are how the lipsticks look so this is the full lipstick and then the refillable ones this is the order we're gonna go in i'm gonna start off with the first one since it's in the actual lipstick bullet or packaging and then we're gonna go with these like this one's creamy that one's matte creamy and matte so it looks like we have three creamy ones and two mattes so okay let's start so starting off with the first one which is a matte lipstick it's the shade 22a This is the shade 22A. And in daylight, this is 22A. Moving on to the next one, this is shade 108A. This is the shade 108A. And in daylight, this is 108A. Moving on to 100R. This is the shade 100R. And in daylight, this is 100R. Moving on to the next shade, which is 107A. This is the shade 107A. And in daylight, this is 107A. Last but not least, this 22R. This is the shade 22R. And 
In daylight, this is 22R. Hey fam, OMG. Okay, you guys, this, ooh, these lips. Before I get started, let me give you some info about these and then we could talk about them. The Valentino Rosso High Pigment Refillable Lipstick. The entire lipstick retails for $45 and the refillable lipstick retails for $30. They come in 45 shades. These lipsticks deliver striking color to your lips in one stroke. They come in lip colors of matte and satin finishes. The highlighted ingredients is Roma Light Complex Light Reflecting Color Boosting Pearls. Now that we have that info, whoa pigment it's a very vibrant pigment that's what's standing out for me is the one swipe pigment you get and then when you build it up it just becomes so much more pigmented and it builds up so freaking smoothly you can't really see texture on my lips this is a satin shade and the first shade and second shade this is more of a true red. This is more of a blue undertone red, which is my fave, you already know. I've never tried refillable lipsticks. I didn't know how easy it is. Like you just pull it out and then kind of pop it back in and you have a whole lipstick. The entire lipstick with the refillable lipstick and the packaging is $45. And then the refillable ones, these alone are $30. If you wanna buy them individually and then the pack, which is this package right here, retails for 160 so i just wanted to give you the prices valentino is a high-end brand as you guys know but i feel like these are such a pretty luxe lipstick when it comes to makeup super high-end lipsticks come in like the best packaging i swear i would just buy it for the packaging because it's just so freaking pretty it just sitting there on your vanity looking all cute but also it's a good product it feels very hydrating it's really really pigmented and like you guys see these swatches look really really good i will say that my favorite shade 107a something about it it's like the perfect nude because it's more on the pinky side it's not on the neutral side it just worked out with my lip tone beautifully yeah that's the one i'd like i mean i love the reds but you guys know i'm a nude girl and if i'm gonna buy something for $45 I better use it every day okay although I may use it up but you know what I mean that first red is really really beautiful too that's I would say my second favorite like this one right here oh but oh talking about swatches let me show you in daylight how they look especially the reds as you can see they both do have different undertones you can see one is more of a bright and then the other one has more of the blue undertone and as I swatched them on my lips they swatched very similarly on my arm very very creamy Creamy, very pigmented and that's really what you get with I feel like these types of lipstick especially a very high-end brand like Valentino you get a good quality product that brings pigment something that it should be embedded like there is there shouldn't be question whether a lipstick is pigmented and there's no question because as you can see these lipsticks are beautiful they do transfer of course look but I still have the color. The red did stain the lips a little bit. I don't really mind stained lips because you're left with a bit of a color, you know? Also guys, if my bronzer's looking a little splotchy, it's because I'm testing a new one out. It's already up. Oh, it's the Laura Mercier one. I don't know if you could see it here, but if you do, that's what it is. I really like them. I think you get the high quality product that the price tag is. You know, that's really what I was looking for when I swatched these lipsticks for you. I think these shades are beautiful and luscious and creamy and pigmented. They applied super, super easily. I will say they do all have like a fruity scent. It's not too potent. You can smell it. You know, it's potent enough where as you apply it, you can really, you can smell it. It's not strong, strong, but there is a scent. So keep in mind. Amelia, I have major cleavage going on. Don't mind that. So I wasn't going to do an e-test and then I'm like, I'm hungry. I need to eat. I still have my lips on. I did dab my lip on a paper towel, so it's not as creamy, but I got birria tacos. I did not know what to eat. I was like really thinking about it. I thought about it for like an hour. So I'm like, go get some food. And here we are. So I've had birria tacos here before. This is how it looks. So I got two birria, just this shredded beef. I got a dorado queso, which is a hard shell taco with beef and cheese. And a molita, which is like this tostada thing with beef and cheese also. I love cheese, although I'm lactose. 
I just love it and I just deal with the consequences, you know? And then with birria tacos comes this thing called consume. It's a beef broth. And then I got me an horchata. So you guys, thank you so much for all the love in the Fenty video when I had Puerto Rican food. Oh, that food was so bomb. Okay, so I am, ooh, I'm gonna dip this like this and chop down. Mmm. Mmm. Another thing I thought about was, I'm like, we have to eat test these lipsticks when they cost $40, you know? Damn, I'm surprised. Look how good it looks. Damn. Wow, it's barely coming off. Oh, okay, Valentino. Hmm. Okay, on to taco number two. You guys, I'm so happy the sun's out longer now. It's moved my, maybe about half an hour. I was telling my friend the other day, I feel like a weather person because I look at the sky and I know if the sun's gonna be out, which means I can do a lip swatch. Sometimes by 10 o'clock, I can see the sky and I'm like, no, it's too gloomy for a lip swatch. And today, literally at 9 a.m., I was like, heck yeah, it's gonna be perfect. If I remember correctly, I think I started my eat test eating birria tacos. I think my first eat test, I think, was the Maybelline Superstay Vinyl, the first set that came out. I'm gonna go with my queso taco. I'm gonna get some of my green salsa. I love green salsa. You have to dip. It's like, it doesn't taste the same if you don't dip. This has so much cheese on it, but it's so good. You guys, ever since being um, a content creator full time, it's been so different. I didn't think it would be as different as it is, but it's more like the calmness that I have. I have so much more time to think about content, to do it at my time, my speed, you know? So I really love that. And I didn't even know I needed that until I had it. Cause you guys know when I had a nine to five, I was still on it, like still working just as hard. But like today I was able to sleep in and think about like my week, like how it's gonna go on. And I don't know, I just feel like that type of stuff I didn't have before, you know? Cause I didn't have time to think about too much in advance. No lie, look at this lipstick. It's white. Or just tap. See, I told you it does stain. But damn, it hasn't even smeared. Wow, I am so surprised. I was almost certain that wasn't gonna happen. Okay, I'm having the mulita. I just have to take a piece. <laughs> this ain't a spot. All right, you guys, I think this is doing it. This lipstick looks bomb. It smeared a little bit. But damn, this is good. I am totally surprised, but maybe not. It's just the quality that just kind of stays on your lip. I like it, I like it. Maybe throughout the night, we'll just continue to have this tint, which is really nice. You guys, the lip is pretty much off. My lips look a little crusty. It lasted a good while, I will say, for it to be a creamy lipstick, you know? Let me know your thoughts. Have you tried these Valentino lipsticks? I see on Sephora they have really good reviews. I will link them down below for you guys if you want to check them out. And let me know your thoughts because I'm kind of feeling it. Like this is one of those two, like especially this red, this last one. It's like a holiday red, huh? This is it. I love you guys so much. Thank you as always for hanging out with me and spending a little bit of your day with me. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, click the button right there, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!